Hey guys, today is a hot or not on this bracelet that you guys have seen me wear in like every one of my videos for the last couple months. This is the Phyton S Pro Titanium Bracelet, and that probably sounds really scary. You're like, whoa, titanium. <laughs> On the underside of this, there are magnets that help with blood flow, which blood helps heal. So, like, I hurt my wrist, and I've mentioned this before, that I have kind of a wide freestyle stroke, so I do accidentally hit people and other- hit arms with other people in other lanes. So it does make my wrist hurt. Since I have broken this, so it's kind of weak, and when I hit it over and over again, it starts to hurt a lot. And my acupuncturist actually recommended this bracelet for me, and it really helps. And this doesn't just help with like wrist pain. My dad actually got this and it helped with his lower back pain. He has sciatica, so a vertebrae in his back is pinching a nerve which sends like shooting pain down his leg and it really really hurts so he's on pain meds for it. This bracelet helped take the edge off of it so now it's kind of a dull ache and he doesn't have to take as many pain meds now, so that's really awesome. His pain is so bad that he's considered surgery for it, and the fact that this helps is absolutely awesome because surgery can be really scary. So this really, really helps with the pain, and this isn't one of those things where you put it on and whoa, the pain is gone. It's not like that. You don't feel the pain going away until you take it off. So at swim meets, I have to take this off because you're not allowed to wear like big accessories or you can get DQ'd. So I have to take this off and my pain will actually come back through the meet when I have this off and it's kind of creepy. Because I'll get out of a race and my wrist will start throbbing and I'm like, where's my bracelet? I need my bracelet. Actually at the meet I had last weekend, I lost this and I was freaking out. I was looking everywhere. It was an outdoor meet, so I was looking all over the tent area on the ground. I looked in the locker room. I looked around the pool. And finally, when I double-checked the locker room, it was underneath one of the changing benches. And I was like, oh. I was starting to freak out because this thing is amazing and I needed it. And I was like, I cannot lose this. Yeah, because if I had actually lost this, I would have literally ordered one right there at the meet on my phone. <laughs> so they have three different sizes, small, medium, large. The small is for a 6.25 circumference wrist. The medium is 6.75 inches. And the large is... wait, I gotta look. And the large is for a 7.5 inch wrist. I got the small, and the way I measured was I took some ribbon here. Look at his face. So I just took some ribbon and you line up the end of the ribbon with the rest of it and then you just pull the string tight with your other fingers. This is kind of a hard thing to do, but you know. So you just pull it tight like that. And then wherever the end of the ribbon meets the other part of the ribbon, just pinch it right there. Take the ribbon off. And that right there. This is about how big my wrist is. If you take a ruler, you can just line this up with the end of it and then look at what the measurement is. And my wrist is a little less than 6.5 inches in circumference. And with these bracelets, you don't want it to be too loose that it moves around. So going a little bit smaller, I think, would probably be the best thing to do. So I ordered the small, which is 6.25 inches, and my wrist is a little bit less than 6.5, like I said. And when you are measuring your wrist with the ribbon, you don't want to be measuring the size you want the bracelet to be. You want to be measuring your actual wrist, so you want to make sure you pull it tight all the way around your wrist. Not like super tight, but you know, you don't want to make it loose like this bracelet. You see, I do have a little bit, a little bit extra right here, but that's good so it doesn't create any marks on me because it's too tight. It's a really great size because it's just, just a little bit loose that you see it can move just a little bit there. So my dad got this bracelet in the bright blue color. I got the medium size because his wrist is just a little bit bigger than mine and his fits about the same as mine, which is just being just a little bit loose. Something about this is if you're like changing into clothes or putting on a swimsuit and you rub your wrist against it, it'll actually fold down like that and then it'll just stay like that and sometimes I don't even notice since it is a little bit looser and my friend will notice and she'll like reach over and flip it over for me and I'm like, oh! Thank you. <laughs> Speaking of, she also got one of these because she was having a little bit of lower back pain and it helped her too. And she was she was like 
whoa. <laughs> My acupuncture specifically recommended this brand and I'll have this linked down below. I did buy a different brand because it was cheaper and I didn't know there would be such a big difference and it did not work as well at all. So I went and got this one which is $20 on Amazon and it works way better. So I don't know what it is about this one, it just worked better. <laughs> this one's great for swimmers because it's silicone and it doesn't get, it doesn't absorb the water. <laughs> The other one that I did get was sort of like hairband material, so it absorbed water and it was like wet for a couple hours after practice and it was kind of annoying. Um, so this one is absolutely awesome. This Phytin bracelet is definitely a hot item. I really recommend that you guys get it for any pains that you have. Link will be in the description below to this exact brand if you're interested. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Leave me a comment down below on what you'd like me to review next and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! You always start it when I'm doing something with my nose. <laughs> I'm serious. Okay. Wait, what? So, I thought I really, really need to do a review of the... So, oh, I have a hairband on my wrist. No, stay with me. I have it on my screen. So it helps with blood throw. Blood throw. Okay. This Phi 10 bracelet is sto. Sto. Where, and you meet the end of the. What? can't play with strings with a cat next to you.